Hey Aquarius, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is going to be your bonus reading for the week of April 13th through the 17th. So let's just jump right in and see what messages we get for you. So we have 10 of cups at the bottom of the deck. So some of you could be manifesting a new beginning with somebody or really this is just about your happiness, your, um, you know, moving forward in life and feeling successful, feeling like you're doing the right thing, feeling like you're on the right path. I feel like you're just very focused on your future right now. Um, we have the two of pentacles, queen of swords, four of pentacles, page of pentacles, justice, ten of wands and the queen of cups i feel like you've come out of a long battle here with something and i feel like you're finally on the other side of this i feel like you realize that you know you've come this far you're now moving forward you're looking at the future there's things to look forward to and i feel like you're just really on the other side of a situation here with the two of wands and the justice card i feel like you're able to move forward because something has been put right something has been uh, made right you know the justice has finally arrived and so you've maybe taken care of a legal matter you've taken care of some sort of contract that you were bound to or really someone here made something right with you and so now that has been done the due has been paid and you're finally able to look forward into the future you're not stuck in the present anymore or you're not stuck in the past you know you're really you're, you have your eyes on something much bigger here but again there was something that needed to be made right first with the queen of swords and the page of pentacles i feel like moving forward the things that you're looking forward to i feel like they're really specific i feel like you have your eye on an, a, a very specific opportunity here an offer is coming towards you and i think you're only going to accept it if it's by your terms whatever this is you know you really have a, a very logical uh, mind about you right now aquarius where you know unless it, it it's by your rules or unless it goes by you know what you are okay with you know you're very certain and very um, direct here with this energy so you're not taking no for an answer but you're also not you know letting someone fool you into thinking something that isn't true or you're not letting someone kind of skip out on reading you the fine print so i feel like you're looking at all the details before agreeing to something so with a particular offer here that's coming through i feel like you're going to want to look at the fine details you're, you're going to want to look at the fine print and really read through everything and be sure that it matches what you're willing to um, accept here that it matches your standards it matches your expectations but i do feel that a lot of you are going to be um, encountering a new offer here it could be work related with the four of pentacles and the ten of wands i feel like because of the situation that you went through recently um you're finding that you're keeping your energy to yourself instead of allowing yourself to become overwhelmed i feel like you've learned this lesson here in the past where you allowed certain situations to get the best of you or you became overwhelmed or you became stressed out and that heaviness of having to carry all of these things on your own or you know just the 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 reality of it it was a lot for you and so i feel like now you're really taking into account the need to preserve your energy the need to take care of yourself the need to keep you know yourself grounded and i feel like you're you're being more serious with who you know you're spending your time with or you're being more um careful you know about the things that you're spending time and energy on it's also money related i feel like a lot of you could be saving because you don't want to stress about a part like um a particular financial situation you could be you know kind of going through something where you need to save money in order to avoid having to stress about it later so i just i feel like overall you're just being more careful in preserving your energy your peace your mind um because you don't want to stress like you have in the recent past with the justice and the queen of cups i feel like there was a justice uh, made here within regards to a certain relationship i feel like you gave your all you did what you could in a certain situation and finally you know you got the justice you got the karmic payback you got things to go your way because you didn't do anything wrong in the situation all you did was give your best effort you gave your love you gave your attention you did what you could and at the end it was at the hand of you know justice at the hand of karma where things finally were put to a balance but i feel like you're satisfied with the way things turned out because you were left unharmed okay you were left um unaffected in a, in a negative way you know like you were you were not 
at all you know um on the losing end of this and so i feel like this is just kind of saying you're satisfied you're okay your cup is full um especially since justice has finally arrived okay let's clarify the two of wands chariot so a lot of you um are definitely moving forward you're finally taking that energy and saying okay now i can do this with with my time you're not you know you're not stuck in any particular situation anymore and after time of waiting after time of finally you know um having to go through something you're you're moving forward you're, you're taking this journey um okay hold on about that shall we this has never happened before in a reading uh but so the tv just suddenly turned on and there was a sound of a car beeping so i'm gonna interpret this for you aquarius i feel like what just happened is a very good example of what you might have just gone through or recently going through it's like you 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 had all this time that you were waiting and finally now that you're free from this it's like you just want to honk and you just want to beep and you just want to get on the car and go it's like anything that gets in your way now you're just going to beep at it you're just going to go you know full-on rage um really to me this is just saying you're ready to go you're ready to move forward you're ready to progress and i think that what just happened is kind of like one of those situations where it's like i can't even i can't even make it up you know it's like sometimes the universe really does work in mysterious ways but really to me this is really confirming aquarius that you're ready to move forward after a situation here has passed um to clarify the um these were the cards that were at the bottom of the deck to clarify the two of wands we have page of cups and the seven of wands um with the chariot here so i honestly feel like what this is saying is that you are defending yourself against someone here that you know was taking advantage of your love or you defended yourself against someone that you had a connection to you had a bond with but they didn't appreciate your you know your energy they didn't appreciate what you were willing to give to this and so now i feel like this is you standing up for yourself and saying i'm only going to give my cup and my energy to someone that appreciates it to someone that is going to do right by me i feel like this is just saying that you're not going to allow someone to take your guard down um unless you know for sure that they're tr that they're real you know that it's true that it's genuine um yeah okay two of wands so moving forward in the future you're not going to settle for less you're going to defend your position always and only accept the good things that are coming that's interesting that's i think that's so funny that happened all right let's clarify the page of pentacles we have the hermit to me, this is saying, again, you are not going to accept any offers until you read the fine print, until you really study it, you look at it, you read it, and you fully understand what is happening. So to clarify, wow, OMG. Okay, to clarify Page of Pentacles, we have Wheel of Fortune and the World. This is the epitome of a new cycle beginning. This is the epitome of you accepting an offer that does work for you and suddenly everything changes and goes in your favor. I feel like this is really also confirming that do not accept something unless it looks right, okay? Because when you accept the right thing, that's really where all of these positive changes will happen. So I feel like if you take your time and you really study something or you really look into something before accepting it, you'll make space for the right opportunity. You'll make space for the right offer. And so I think when it comes through, you're gonna be able to spot it out because it'll look different from the rest. And then that's when you'll be able to say, okay, yeah, this is what I, this is the new cycle I want to begin. And then therefore so many more things will come out of that. So that's really exciting. I really, really like that for you, Aquarius. All right, let's clarify the, let's clarify the 10 of wands. Right, three of cups at the bottom of the deck yeah so with regards to you know your relationships and your and this is not just relationships with you know a romantic person but just in general i feel like the people that you're spending your time with if they give you this heavy energy if they make you feel stressed or overwhelmed i feel like you're just not you're going to choose to not be around them because i feel like right now you're in a in a very um you know i don't want to say vulnerable position but i just feel like you don't have time to waste on people that drain your energy 
you don't have time to waste on people that take advantage of your energy i feel like right now your time your money your energy your your love is precious aquarius and you need to preserve it at all costs so that you're ready when the next thing comes because again there's a lot of changes coming towards you and you need to be ready for that um so cl to clarify the ten of wands we have two of pentacles and three of wands to me this is saying not only are you being picky with who you're spending your time with but you're also going to make very very uh, wise decisions here in regards to the movements that you're making in the future you're going to be very selective very um you know specific very direct and clear on the decisions you're going to make and who you're going to make them with so to me this is saying aquarius that not only do you have a clear vision of the future you know exactly what it is that you want in that future you know exactly what it is that you want to see what you want to experience what you want to feel and so to me this is saying that what you're doing right now keep doing that keep going in that direction keep choosing what's right for you and i really think that you know what's what's going to expand here is going to be very 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 bright a um, lot of good changes coming but again you're the one making the decisions here you're the one in control of your life right now and there is honestly so much good coming towards you i mean i can't even make it up all right aquarius i'm gonna end it there if you like this reading and it resonated please give it a like please subscribe and i will see you in the next one